Hello my family members. Today we will cover 21st July of campus question on cloud and network security and we will discuss briefly. So let's go. So the first question is in the given example of URL with different components which of the following is a sub directory so before telling you the answer let me clear you that https is a scheme right and the blog dot hubspot.com so here blog is subdomain and the hubspot is main domain right and the dot com is the top level domain right and this is after the slash this is actually the sub directory right so the answer will be sub directory actually you will have numbering right one two three four this way right so you will have to answer four right so the answer will be marketing so the next question is which of the following network device is used to transmit digital signal over the internet repeater modem switch or hub okay i am answering actually let me clear the concept that is a repeater actually is a device which is used to extend the reach of a network by amplifying and regenerating signals right and modem which is actually net it is also a network device which is used to transmit digital signals over the internet uh, by converting digital data from a computer into analog signals right so and switch what is this switch is a network device that operates at the data link layer right uh, that is layer 2 uh, of the osi model right and it is used to connect device within a local area network right and hub hub is also a networking device that operates at physical layer layer one right uh, and uh, unlike switches hubs do not have the capability or intelligently manage data traffic right so i hope you have got the answer right the right answer is modem uh, right so let's go to the next question after eight or nine questions you, you will have Two quiz question right please uh, participate in the quiz and give me the answer right so the question is bridge networking component can be used to join an unsealed twisted pair UTP cabling and fiber optic cabling a second statement is token ring and Ethernet so what will be the answer the answer is actually only Two A will be the right answer, right? How I am answering? Actually, a bridge is a networking component that can be used to join different types of network segments, such as token ring uh, and Ethernet, and uh, it operates at the data link layer, right? Uh, layer two of the OSI model, right? And it is uh, it is capable of filtering and forwarding traffic between segment based uh, on MAC addresses, right? I hope you have got the answer. So let's go to the next question. Which of the following type of error occurs in both parallel and serial communication system? Uh, let me clear a little concept here. That is what is hybrid what is burst error multiple bit error framing error bit error right so actually there are two communication system that is parallel and serial mainly in parallel communi parallel communication system uh, mainly the faults or errors are cross talk mainly cross talk right and in serial communication error uh, mainly the error is noise error bit error right frame error so answer will be actually burst error right burst error is the type of error that occurs in both parallel and serial communication system 
right where consecutive bits uh, are, are actually affected by noise and interfaces right in the interferences so let's go to the next question which of the following type of cloud deployment model is used when a cloud service needs to obtain additional resources from other clouds because its own resource resources are being utilized at full capacity so hybrid cloud private private cloud pu public cloud community cloud what will be the answer okay let me tell you that what are the functions of them actually a hybrid cloud is a it is a deployment model involves a combination of private and public clouds allowing data and application to be shared between them right and it is mainly usually used in institute right and the private cloud is also a deployment model involves in dedicated infrastructure and resources that are used exclusively by a single organization and this model is actually used by uh, private companies i mean uh, the companies who actually store very private data and uh, their um, money revenue data right so they use this private cloud and what is public cloud it is a deployment model also which provides computing resources as a service over the internet right it is also used by companies but which the company which is a startup company they mainly use this public cloud and what is community cloud community cloud is also deployment model which is actually shared infrastructure that is designed for specific groups right so actually the hospitals uh, are mainly used community cloud so what will be the answer according to the according to what i told you so the answer will be actually hybrid cloud right so let's go to the next question microsoft office 365 is an example of which of the following type of cloud service model the answer will be c saas right software as a service uh, microsoft office is uh, an example of saas right uh, actually with saas user can access software applications over the internet without the need for local installation or management right so in the case of uh, Office 365 uh, users can use web based version of the popular Microsoft Office application, right? Uh, right, like uh, Word, Excel, and PowerPoint, as well as other collaboration, right? So the answer will be SaaS. Next question is In TCP IP model, which of the following protocol is used to use on internet layer? Internet layer means the network layer, right? so think a little then answer if possible then please answer me in the comment box so the answer will be igmp right igmp means internet group management protocol right actually in the tcp ip model the network layer is responsible for routing and forwarding data packets right I have mentioned full details, full functions of every layer in the previous cloud video. If you did not watch, kindly watch that. It, this, this was also very informative and very conceptual, right? So please watch that. So the answer will be IGMP, right? So the next question is, in AWS, you can create DB instances by using which of the following? AWS Management Console, Amazon uh, RDS APIs or AWS command line interfaces. So opt among them. What will be the answer? The answer actually is one and two. Actually, you can create databases, database instances using both of the AWS management console and and Amazon RDI APIs, right? Uh, the actually uh there is a little more concept behind the question i will not uh, take time to consult about them right 
so let's go to the next question that will be better for now if you want to share data between different ec2 instances then which of the following file storage solution you should opt for ebs s3 storage gateway or dfs sorry efs so efs means actually elastic file system right actually the answer will be el elastic file system d uh, actually amazon if efs is a scalable file storage service right that allows multiple ec2 instances to share files with a common data source right so i hope you have uh, got a little knowledge in this video right so let's go to the quiz question that was for you right so the first quiz question is which service in I ipsec is provided by encapsulating security payload esp but not by authentication editor a protocol what will be the answer please give me the uh, appropriate answer in the comment box and give me two quiz questions in a single comment right so the next quiz question is find out the odd one right oh, which one is not actually fitting the arrangement right so answer the following questions which are which and which are actually supposed to do by you right so please answer this and sub and suggest me which content i should make and which content should i make first right so best of luck for your exams thank you